I know I already explained this in the text above, but I created this coloring activity as a way to open and clean your chakras or bring awareness to the chakras that do need help. Um, I created this because I wanted a way to connect with my chakras easier than having to sit and do a meditation or sit and do yoga poses. Um, so if you print out the files that I provided, you can color each one. They're each labeled so you know which one goes with which chakra. You can also look at the other links on my site and match the symbols to the ones on for each chakra. I'm not going to go through each one that I colored the first time that I did this, but I went through and I use colored pencils, use whatever you want to color it with, but I use colored pencils and what I did is I put them in a container and I used my intuition to grab the colors that I felt or that jumped out at me. Um, I know that on the other pages I give color associations for each chakra, which they do. Each one has a specific color that's associated with it, but in my mind, the world isn't black and white, so why should the chakras be the same way? So I let my intuition tell me what colors to use, and then I just kind of colored the pictures in. And when I finished, there were a few that I didn't like, and there were some that I really liked. And the ones that I didn't like were the chakras that needed cleaning or needed to be opened and balanced. So what I did is I did like yoga poses and meditation specific for just the chakras that needed the help. And then I colored those pictures again and I was more satisfied with the second result. So that's why I created this because anybody can do it and coloring is a form of meditation. It brings focus to what you're doing and you forget about everything else that's going on around you. So I mentioned in another video that I have a hard time connecting with my root chakra. So here is the picture of the root chakra. I wasn't overly satisfied with how it turned out and I figured that'd probably be the case because I have a hard time connecting with my root chakra. Now the one I liked the most was my crown chakra and that's the one that I connect with the most and that's what this one looks like. Now you notice that I used more than just purple or violet and I thought it turned out really good. So for me, my crown chakra had all of those colors in it and that's what I mean by everything's not black and white. So even though the association page may say like the root chakra is associated with the color red, each person's different. Your chakra may have more pinks and reds and other colors in there. It may not be just red. So the whole point of this is to follow your own intuition and your own guide, not what somebody else came up with and what somebody else told you it should be. Have fun!